going to be another warm day today. I should say hot. Yesterday we had a high of 102, so another triple digit day in the book. So far we've had 31 with 110 being the hottest day, El Paso. Last year we were at 47, 106 was the hottest. Las Cruces, you've had 24. And I think once we move through the rest of the week, we will finally see the temperatures cool down a bit this morning. As you're enjoying your morning breakfast or maybe going out for a stroll, a jog, bike ride, 7 o'clock, we're at 83 degrees, and at 9 o'clock, we're close to 90 degrees. 76 is where we're at currently, El Paso, and it is hot, Phoenix Sky Harbor at 91. So our current weather setup today, really for the next seven days, we will have that chance for showers and thunderstorms. And just like yesterday, you notice the storms started to roll through. Doppler Day was tracking the storms. And again, I think we'll see much of the same. So during our later shows, keep an eye on that. And of course, I'll be bringing you the updates during ABC 7 at noon. There's a live look at Doppler Radar, which does show we're just tracking a few clouds in our future track computer model. Your morning drive will not consist of showers, thunderstorms, so you're in the clear through 8 o'clock. And then by 5 o'clock, you'll notice the storms start to roll in. They're going to hang around through 11 o'clock. Then we'll get a break Wednesday morning, just like what we saw this morning. And then we'll see a repeat of that really for the next seven days. So there's that 30% chance for showers. Best chance will be late at night, 40% chance. 98 will be the high today for Fort Bliss, 99 for Socorro, upper 90s for Clint and Fabens. Here's your seven day forecast. We're in the mid 90s, mid to low 90s, really through the weekend with overnight lows in the 70s.